This is how a normal extendable arm goes onto the back of a monitor. Uh, I got this extendable arm because I get a sore bum sitting down and I wanted to stand up. So this is the easiest way you can lift the monitor up and down as you're standing up or sitting down. I got this arm quite cheap. Uh, so that's how it normally goes on. Now on the newer monitors, the bigger monitors, like this one over here, my big monitor, it doesn't have that that uh, fitting on the back, the four screw holes. It has this silly little thing at the bottom that makes the whole thing very wobbly. Uh, this is a 34 inch monitor. And the reason I like big monitors is because my eyesight's not as good as it was, so uh, I need one. So, okay, to so here I, I, I can't put this type of arm onto this monitor. So how I've got over that is I've, I've made, this is a double armed monitor. I've made this little bracket here with a bolt welded on. So it's pretty simple. It's just um, three pieces of steel in an H, welded here and bolted on to the arm with these four screws like it would normally go on to this one uh, but I've got this this bolt welded on. So that bolt will go up this female fitting here. It's got a hole in it. You can see that. So you can take the bottom off pretty easy. So you leave this on and this will slip over this. Uh, so that's the idea. Now to get this to get this holding tight on to this, I was going to put in um, uh, putty, um, you, you know, um, quick setting putty. But the trouble with that is, once it's set, I'll never be able to get this out again. So my wife suggested, why don't I just wrap gaffer tape around the top of the bolt, which is a really good idea. And that's what I'm going to do. So that's what I'm going to do now. So, okay, I've wrapped uh, gaffer tape around it. And I'm going to lift the monitor up and slide it over this. And I'll still leave the, the base on just in case I have to put on more. So, here she goes. And this should slip into here. Uh, I'll probably put too much gaffer tape on. So, yeah. Okay. So, I'll have to. Take some off. I don't think it's much that I have to take off. Give it another go.
as you can see there's still a bit of movement in there but I'm sure I'll be able to take it out and so this is the monitor when I'm standing and this is it when I'm sitting down So it does work, I just need a bit of fine tuning. This is my desk in uh, sitting down mode. And uh, here it is in stand up mode. So the, uh, the screen is pretty close to my face which is great as far as I'm concerned. So uh, I can do, you know, a couple of hours standing up or an hour standing up and an hour sitting down. That breaks up the day, breaks up the pain in my bum. So here it is from the other side. I got a bit of um, twiddling and stuff like that to do just to get it exactly how I want it, but uh, basically this is how it is. I'm pretty stoked. Uh, I've got this piece of timber along the, uh, the back of my desk to take the weight and uh, not to twist the, um, the red cedar planks on the actual desk. So I've got to sort of resolve all that, resolve the, um, the wires and um, but anyway that's generally how it is, and I'm stoked.